night of doubt and fear, a leader shines bright and clear. Not to overpower, but to lead with his great wisdom and selfless deeds. With these lines, a very enthusiastic morning to respected judges, respected teachers, and my dear friends. This is Elspeth Bhart from Shiksha Bharti and is going to speak on the topic when I become the Prime Minister, I will. I have no intention of pretending in advance, but if I become the Prime Minister, I will ensure that every Indian has a secure place to live with a strong defense system, has food to eat with prosperous farmers, cloth to wear and access to health care and quality education. In my nation today, out of 15% female population, only 10 to 15% are member of parliament. So, I will ensure that schemes are executed and women harassment is persecuted so that we have a feminist and corruption free nation. I will ensure quality education to my young minds to abolish child labor. I will stop paper leaks as I can see them crumbling my nation's future. In my nation today, richly high taxes and poor food service. Isn't that wrong? So I will ensure a uniform taxation system is followed to strengthen my nation's economy. Like the recent cyber attack in Uttarakhand, other states are also vulnerable to cyber attacks that can threaten national security via terrorism. So I will recruit top engineers for government security, stopping brain drain as well. Our existence is completely dependent towards our environment. But today, due to disharmony between our developmental goals and environment, we have tsunamis, flash floods and what not. So, I would organize national summits for clean technology every month in which top technologies, top environmentalists can meet and can develop clean and green solutions for our problems. As a PM, I envision my India to emerge as a world leader under versus Hayab Kutumbaga. To achieve a politically, culturally and socially strong nation, we the young generation should work harder towards our national common future. So, sustain your ethics with your working culture as it's your life that lights up the world. Thank you.